<laughs> Stop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> My head's cut off. Your worst nightmare. <laughs> it literally is my worst nightmare. Okay, you have to be normal. That's not normal. Miss Newton acting like a teacher to her husband. Not Soon yet. To be. Yeah. Take it back. Am I supposed to make this? Oh, yeah. Miss Newton. Well, okay. You have such fluffy hair, you would be cut well, off. Aim the camera up so it's like a. You told me to put it down. No, I said aim it. Oh. <laughs> I hate you. Welcome to Early Adventures. <laughs> Why don't you do it? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is Early Adventures, this is Miss Newton, and I'm so excited to have you guys back on my channel today. <laughs> so, here we go, we're gonna start the interview, you know, just there. Not... Start the interview, or the questionnaire. With... Hi guys! <laughs> channel today we have a very special guest today this is my fiance Christopher Michael Coates aka babe hello babe b-a-e god <laughs> so today we wanted to do or I wanted to do the teacher partner tag and this was started by Michelle at Pocketful of primary she did this with her boyfriend so disclaimer to you and to them I didn't come up with these questions um, so some of these may or may not apply to us um, but basically, I'm just gonna ask him a series of questions. The first ten are about our relationship, and the first or the second group of questions are about my teaching career. Can you, can you fail these questions? What do you mean? Can you fail? Like, are you gonna grade me if I don't understand? Oh, the yeah, I'm gonna give you a grade of life. Teachers, a grade of life. No, yeah. um, but you can get them wrong, and in fact, I think you might get most of them. Wrong. <laughs> Let's just do it. Ready? Okay. Okay. Question number one. Okay. And this also doesn't okay. really apply to us. And you have to be appropriate. And you can't cuss. Okay. Mm. Question number one. Where was our first date? Uh, so our first date, is this the first time we met? Like the first night like we met? the first time we went out. No, the like first time we, we met. We didn't, we didn't go on dates. Well, no. We were too poor. Be, yeah, no, it would be. So we met at a, at a friend's Halloween party. Mm -hmm. And then we went out together on Halloween night. And then it was the next night after I came into your work and was like, hey, do you want to come over and yeah. watch a movie? This was before, actually Netflix was around. So it wasn't like a Netflix and chill. <laughs> it I don't was think just that like, really existed yet. Yeah, no. We watched, like, what did we watch? Do you remember? Nightmare on Elm Street. Yeah, I, I told him I was And like, she <laughs> pretended that she took, oh my God, I love horror movies so much. They're my favorite. And now today I couldn't even pay her money to watch one. She made that whole thing up. Yeah, so it was lied. false advertisement. And now look. Here I am. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, question number two. That's correct, I guess. But we didn't really go on dates, we were too poor. In fact, I paid for all of his drinks for the first, like, two months we dated. Yeah, I got in trouble at my job and got suspended, so. Fired. I got fired after. But I got suspended <laughs> okay, this time. question number two. What was your first, first, okay, well, we have to do a little bit of disclaimer. We met in high school. Well, really middle school. Yeah. But we weren't friends. We weren't not friends. We were like chill. We, well, like, we just never hung out. We like said hi to each other, but we yeah. weren't friends. Okay. What was your first impression of me? And let's do this not in high school. <laughs> first impression. Like when we re met. I mean, I honestly can't really. I mean. Remember. Yeah. <laughs> me either. Yeah. I mean, uh, I, honestly, first impression, the first thing I remember is that for some reason she was hitting me in the head with this inflatable <laughs> hammer. It was an ice cream cone. It was, yeah. See, an ice cream <laughs> cone? I don't know if it was like her kindergarten way of flirting with me, but I remember being so annoyed that I turned to look at one of my friends like, she hits me in the head with the ice cream cone one more time, I'm gonna freak out. And then I did. And then she probably did, and I probably just sat there like. And then we hung out from then on. Yeah. And then we were <laughs> It worked. Kindergarten flirting works. Yeah. I don't really remember making the choice to hit you with it. Really? I remember where we were, and I remember it happening, but I number three, you'll get this <clears throat> super easily, I think. What am I afraid of? Afraid of? Mm -hmm. What's my biggest fear? There's two. Sharks? And? More sharks? Yeah, there's another one. Spiders? No. Clowns? No. Snakes? Think about it, what am I afraid of? I don't know. I had to remove one from my classroom today. It was on my window. On your window? Really? No, what? It flies. 
Oh, bees, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. work. Yeah, Shark look, stuff. So funny, the most terrified of bees. Like <laughs> one will get with them like 10 feet and it's like, ah! So there was a wasp in my classroom today. This is a true story, I haven't told you. And someone's like, oh, Miss Newton, there's a bee. And I like pretended to be all cool and calm and collected. <laughs> and I was like, it's okay. Got a cup and a piece of paper and like, but it was kind of sick, I think. Literally sweating so. bullets, but trying to sit there and protect her children. Dead serious. No, that's true. That's true fact. And I put a paper, a piece of paper underneath it, and then I like walked outside and then shook the paper and sprinted back inside. And they were like, are you okay? And I'm like, I, I wish one of your students like, oh my god, Miss Newton, it's in your hair! And you would have just died. I would have freaked out. Two thumbs up for that one. Okay. Number four. What's my shoe size? Nine and a half. Yeah. What? Yes, I'm a genius. I have big feet. I'm a genius. You know what that means. Small brain. Oh. <laughs> Big shoes. Okay, number five says, do I have any secret talents? But they're not secrets. So what, like, any like weird things I'm good at? Like weird things? Or like things I'm good at, but maybe not everybody knows. The things I can do. Like instruments. I say piano, but people like know that. Yeah. I guess. Arts? Like crafting? You're pretty crafty. Okay. What about like weird things that I'm good at? I can thinking of one thing in particular with my brain. Oh, you just mean like a, what do you call that? Um, like photographic memory? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so annoying. Like <laughs> never has to study or do anything. And like, when I, every time I take a test or I had to go to class, I literally had to read the whole book front to back 10 times. <laughs> She'd read a book once and it'd be like, remembers everything. Yeah, I have photographic memory. Birthdays, numbers. I can look at a license plate once and remember for oh, the rest of my life. so annoying, I wish I had. But also helpful for you. Yeah. Just in the long run, it's like, out. what's their number? And I'm like, mm, four or four, if four, I need four. to use my credit card for something, she's literally been like, oh, it's this, and here's your expiration date, and this and that. And I'm like, what? Remembers all the numbers, knows everyone's think birthday. We're married. <laughs> I know, yeah, knows everyone's birthday. It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> number six. What am I really bad at? Really bad at? Oh, what was the question again? <laughs> what things you're not good at? <laughs> what am I really bad at? Really bad at. Oh, video games. Mm -hmm. Terrible hand-eye coordination. Yeah. Literally watching her <laughs> try to attempt to play a video game is pretty entertaining. But you do play The Sims, though. Yeah, but that's not like It's not like, a, you know, not like Call of Duty or something. Really. But it's like, like anything hand-eye coordinated. Yeah, it's even like throwing a baseball. I think I tried to watch yeah, you catch a couple times, and pretty sure it wasn't anything like the same I'm also lot. really bad at singing. But I'm probably way worse at singing. Yeah, that's true. I'm way worse I can play instruments, but I... That was actually better than normal. <laughs> was that better than normal? Yeah. Okay. okay. Number seven, what sports did I play? Uh, soccer. Mm -hmm. I know that for sure. My whole life. That's it. Well, I thought you played like softball or something when you were younger. Never. Or baseball. No. I played basketball for like a month. What? Sorry, work. Okay. Um, Just soccer. I mean, I played like basketball in like fourth grade and I cheerleaded for like two days. Oh, I did gymnastics for like a day. Not my thing. Leading shell star. Well, you hand eye coordination, and it's just not. I did track in field middle school. Did you know that? Were you even good? I guess you, I you was actually really like good. You were a fast runner. Yeah, player. I was. And I did high yeah. jump, but I didn't <clears throat> stick with it. Okay. Number eight. <coughs> what drink do I always order? We'll go like alcoholic drink because yeah, I mean, we don't really go get coffee or anything. I mean, we do get coffee sometimes, but we both just drink black coffee. Like, she puts a little bit of cream in hers, yeah. like coconut milk or whatever, mm -hmm. but... Uh, what drink do I order if we were to go to dinner? Oh, it's like gin martinis. I've never ordered a gin martini in my entire life. Am I thinking just because my mom? Oh, I guess a gin and tonic. Yeah, yeah, gin and tonic. With gin a, martinis with, are disgusting. With lime, yeah, gin and tonic. Lemon and lime? Do you do lemon and juice? lime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lemon and lime. Yeah, that's my go-to. Okay, you're doing a lot better than I thought you would. You're gonna bomb the next set though, 100%. The next set? There's a whole set? Yeah, the next 10 are about my teaching. Oh, okay. You might not, okay. No, 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 there's two more. I don't bomb anything. I'm Number nine. Genius. Stop. Number nine. Do we have any traditions together? If so, what are they? Traditions together? Again, I didn't think of these questions, so I don't know, do we? I have to answer it first, I guess. I don't think so. I don't think we really do. No, I mean, besides like the typical, like, oh, it's November our 4th or 5th, it's our anniversary. <laughs> I was so close, it was one day. November 5th. But November 5th. We yeah. don't really have any. When we have kids, we will. Yeah, it's not like every Saturday we do this, or the last Saturday of every month no. we go do this, or go eat here. We, I don't know, we don't do that. No. Yeah. Like we don't have any. We, we're kind of lame. Number 10, complete this sentence. My fiance is blank. <laughs> Be nice. 
She's wonderful. She is, you're wonderful. Okay, that was a really easy adjective. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> the next 10 are about teaching. Maybe? Yeah. Okay. Number one, how many years have I been teaching? One. This is my first year. Number two, what's my degree in? Kinesiology. Mm -hmm. With an emphasis in? I don't remember. Fitness and nutrition, kind of the same thing. How many kids are in my class? 27. Ooh, close. I did not yeah. think you were gonna get 26? it. 26. Uh, what? I knew it was one of those, yeah. How? I don't, know. I don't feel like I ever really talked about that. What's my favorite subject to teach? I don't know if I've ever told you that. Wasn't it, was it US history or history? I mean, I mean, before I started you said, teaching you remember, for real, like, I yeah, teaching in the teaching program, I guess I said that, yeah, but, you did. but I don't teach really US, like history because we teach IB stuff. We don't get to teach like specifically yeah. history. So what, what would be my next favorite to teach? Ooh. Do you think? I would say grammar because you're a grammar <laughs> Nazi. I mean, actually, I do like teaching it, but math right now is my favorite. Oh my goodness. She literally corrects my texts for me. But I'm sure a lot of people didn't have a lot of friends because well, I'm the worst like, at grammar, so all my friends do that. Y-O-U apostrophe R-E, or you are. I know. Do you? I do. Mm -hmm. It's a text, not an essay I'm turning in at school. Why do I need to text like I'm sending it to a professor? You're dating teacher. Teacher? <laughs> professor. You wouldn't if it was a professor. <laughs> <laughs> What's the other one that you say that I hate? What do you mean? Have, what do you eat in the morning? What do I eat in the morning? Mm, what's the first meal of the day? Breakfast. I say breakfast, but I know it's breakfast. But for okay. some reason, <laughs> I say it 10 times fast, I would say breakfast. I'd put an R in there for Brec some reason. Breakfast. Instead of breakfast. Does anybody else say breakfast? If you do, comment below because nobody does. Nobody. Everyone says. What, what do you Okay, have, no one says that. It's what do you What line. do you do with a, if you have to like find a length? Measure of, something? What do you do? Measure. That's not what you say. Yeah. No, you're lying to everybody. I'm not. I what do you say? I said, oh, we need to measure this. Measure. I said, measure, measure. You say measure, and you never say measure. You say measure, always. Well, I don't I know why. Of, I just, I've made fun of you for five years. See, my, my soon-to-be wife makes fun of me all the time. I mean, would it be a healthy relationship if that didn't happen? Probably not. Okay. My favorite thing about teaching. <laughs> What's my favorite thing about teaching? Discipline. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know, is it so like uh, watching kids grow? Like yeah, advancing probably. feedback? Yeah, well, yeah. Watching them progress, even yeah. in like the littlest, but honestly. Well, I like think... when, you know, a kid say to you, like, what was the, the kid's name when you were well, I can't say student anything. teaching? Oh yeah, can't say it, but there's a student that was a really difficult kid, and then when he left, he was like, I, you know, I'm really gonna miss you, or you helped me so much, you don't even know, or something, yeah. and you're like really touched by that. That was pretty great. Yeah. yeah, that's the thing, I think just relationships, the relationships I have with my kids. I mean, the academic growth is great and all, but I like the social growth. Yeah. And just like, that relationship. Okay, I have to tweak this question again, because it's my first year, but it's, how much money did I spend on my classroom this year? Out of your pocket? I mean, it was all out of my pocket. <laughs> Didn't your parents help you? No. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Not at all. I'd say like 2,500 bucks. I would say probably. I don't really, I didn't answer these questions before I asked them, so I'm kind of thinking about it on the spot. I would say, yeah. That was a good guesstimate. Two, I thought. was gonna say two or three grand. Yeah. So we have to keep in mind that I started saving and like buying things for my classroom eight months before I started teaching. So it sounds like a lot, and it is a lot that I shouldn't have to pay for, Just but I do. Lights are blinding, I feel like I'm being interrogated. <laughs> three left, three more. Can you handle it? Let's do it. We have elephants living upstairs. I know the elephants, well, at least their father. He was a childhood friend of mine. Does anybody live in a downstairs apartment with people upstairs that have weights strapped to their feet? Constant no, stamping. not, like, they either bricks, and like, <laughs> literally they play a game, it's called like, let's hop around with bricks on our feet. And it's like a, I don't know, some yeah. kind of fun game they play. Mm -hmm. Or like maybe they just work out a lot and use dumbbells and just throw them on the floor all day. Or like- Kettlebells. Or, <laughs> <laughs> why do I picture them? <laughs> Slam on the floor. Why do I picture their daughter just like jumping off the couch? Just like pancaking. <laughs> yeah. On the floor. That was almost the F word. I know. Sorry. Miss Newton. What? I have to like answer these before I ask you them because otherwise, 
You got like every single question right, literally. She, it was funny before we started this. She's like, like, you're, you're really not gonna, gonna bomb this. You're not gonna know any of these. There hasn't been one except for the being afraid of clowns and snakes. I like love snakes and clowns aren't my favorite. You said you don't like reptiles like literally yesterday. Yeah, and then I said except snakes. Whatever, anyway, well, okay. Fire. What's my must have teacher item? Must have teacher item? Coffee. <laughs> yeah, actually. Yeah. Yeah, God. Okay, if I wasn't a teacher, what would I be doing? Like if you had If I didn't doing... go into teaching, what would I be doing? Oh. Honestly, I don't know. So like, I know you wanted to be a physical therapist and you're doing kinesiology. Mm -hmm. Would you have gone back to school for that though? I probably would. Well, you I don't know, what both, do you think? You just worked at a bar and I worked at a restaurant, so I don't know what you would be doing. I mean, you'd probably still be a coin op. Yeah, but, but what would I, like, had I stopped bartending and went to like, go do something, what do you think I would do? Honestly, I don't know. I know, because I really wanted to be a teacher. Yeah. But I probably would do something with my degree. Probably not physical therapy, but probably like, like athletic training or something. Yeah, because even when, when we first met, you were like really, not really into fitness, but she was like into fitness and nutrition and. Okay, two more. Oh, one more. Hit me with it. If I could change one thing about teaching, what would I change? Change one thing about teaching. I mean, one thing just springs to my mind. I think every teacher would change this. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say the pay. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, that's yeah, the reason yeah, I yeah, yeah. my mind. But that. I mean, that's the obvious. What else would I change? I say class sizes? Yeah, yeah, but I mean, third, I teach third grade and third grade just got a cut, so we're only at 26, which is, which is still more than I would like, but yeah. But those are honestly the main two. Just like I think everything teachers would change. There's yeah, a there's, lot probably, that there's needs so to be much. Changed. Yeah, it's just, yeah. I mean, yeah, it's just a lot. Yeah. I mean, there's like a ton of things you could change to make it better, but just budgetary reasons mm -hmm. you cannot. So it's, yeah. it's just the way that it is. Yeah. Okay. You did a lot better than I thought you would. So you guys can comment down below oh, look, look, and you can rate how good I did when she's in there telling me, oh, you're not going to know anything. I didn't think you wouldn't know things. And I honestly- Proved you wrong. I'm never wrong. <laughs> she's never wrong. Never wrong. Never. I guess happy wife, happy life, right? Okay. Not yet. I'm wrong. We get married in two months. And May 19th. I guess on May 19th. Two months! Are you excited? I'm excited. I love you. We can't wait. And then where are we going on our honeymoon? We're going to Italy. For like two and a half weeks. Three weeks. We're rising up. Just kidding. Three, Three weeks. weeks. Okay, that ends this video. Give this video a thumbs up if you like to see Mr. Coates. <laughs> <laughs> this video a thumbs up if you'd like to see Mr. Coates in any future videos. And make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed already. Oh, what else do I need to say? Um. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button down below. Uh, click the little bell icon if you wanna get notifications to see early adventures every day. And to you guys, I'll see you soon. <laughs> and you have a great day wherever you are. And... Oh my God, we have to go. Bye. Bye.